Hello everyone, this is Rodney Hicks with Exotic Fishing Tanks. Uh, let me go this way. Um, I'm in uh, LA. Uh, about 10 times a year I fly out to some of the wholesalers here in uh, Los Angeles in addition to, of course, heading out to Hawaii two or three times a year. But uh, I am here, as you can see, as Sea Dwelling Creatures uh, here in LA. And uh, it's one of my favorite places. Uh, I've known the guys forever. And uh, uh, let's take a look and see what we got. So I hope you enjoy the video. This is my first videos, uh, video. I typically don't do videos. So let's see if uh, how well this one goes. I'll see you in about 30 seconds. Thanks. Yep. And these are the Hawaiian. These guys are about six to seven inches. These guys are big and awesome. Let's see what else we got up here. We have tons of tamini tangs as well and these are fulleri tangs some fulleri tangs uh, as well these guys are super along with lots and lots of powder bloom lots and lots of powder bloom as well so as I said this is my first time tons of taminis and of course, as I said, you have your good sized blue hippo tanks from Hawaii. And then you got your gold ring. Let's see what else we can find. More polarized, along with Heniocus. These are nice. And you see powder blues. Yep. See what else we have here. Uh, just trying to find you guys some good. Tons of nasal tangs. Tons and tons of nasal tangs at all as well. You can, yep, you can see there's tons. And then of course we have our bigger nasal tangs. We got Clownfish, half flat, and we've got bigger Hawaiian nasos as well. Let's see if there's any. We have, uh, let's see here, we have clown, clown tangs. Tons of clown tanks. And let's see. More nasal tanks. More nasal tanks. Let's see if we have anything neat over here. Uh, let's see. Nothing is in here. We got the keyholes. The all black dwarf angels. And of course, we have. Self-contained as well. But well, let's see what else we got here at Sea Dwelling Creatures. Sea Dwelling Creatures. Let's see what else. What other neat stuff? I have my cart. I'm ready to hand pick fish. And let's see what we got here. We got These are all cell fin tangs up here. I'm looking to see if we have anything neat. Let's see what we can come up with. I love the hand-picked fish. It's one of the best feeling. You have a lot of the file fish, as we can see. And we have an undulated trigger on the other side, upside down. A lot of the dwarf angels as well. And we have a monster, a couple of monsters in here. We see one over there and we see one here. And on the other side, we see the yellow belly hippos. I will definitely get some of the yellow belly hippos. And here we have a unicorn tang from Hawaii.
So as I make my way, we got a snapper, some snappers there. And let's see, we got some goatfish. Goatfish as well here. And here's my absolute favorite. I know these guys are a little more delicate, but these are the sweet lips. Tons and tons of sweet lips. And there's some neat ones. I'm not sure what those guys are in the back, but uh, they're very neat. Squirrelfish. Squirrelfish as well. And I see we have clown grouper. Look at how super duper that looks, the clown grouper. And I can see clown triggers. We got a couple clown triggers there. That's saying, take me, take me, buy me. Me. And let's see if I have anything else that's neat. Look at this yellow belly, this yellow belly puffer. This guy is super. He is amazing, the yellow belly puffer. He almost looks low. Some other puffers. Puffers as well. And some unhappy Napa puffers. These guys are unhappy. Here's a better Napa puffer. Face puffers. Looking for neat fish. This is a saddle grouper. This is another clown grouper. And this is a saddle grouper. Let's see what we got here. Let's see. What else? What else? And we got the mini otters groupers. For those of you who like the mini otters groupers, Many other scoopers. And then up here we have the red breasting. So let's see what else we can find here. And these are some of your rasses. Look at how gorgeous. Hey, I'll get out your way, Juan. Yeah. Here. And this guy is a Scots Ferry. This guy is stunning. Uh, the Scots Ferry. Now sneak right, right by you, Ron. And these are some of the, this is some of the filtration that they use. Skimmer. The skimmer is about 15 feet. And you can see some of the filtration. We can see what they have here. These are your lime green grasses. This is your Australian lime green grass, which is awesome. Another Australian lime green grass. And your scribble bay. These are your scribble dangers. These are the males. Male scribbles. And then your persona babies. Let's 
see what else we got here. And up here we have tons and tons of powder browns. Look how stunning that powder brown looks. These are some of my favorites. Unfortunately, these guys come from Bali. It's very important where the fish comes from. As you can see, it'll say the region in which they come from. Some of the ones from Indonesia aren't nearly as nice. This one here is looks superb. In perfect condition, perfectly comfortable. And this is another part of brown tank from Bali. And this is the algae that they feed the part of brown tanks. So we can see if we have, what else we have in it? I think this is a red, pink margin, a red margin of grass hiding in there. But it's very important what region the wrasses come from. I mean, excuse me, what regions the fish come from. The ones from Indonesia don't typically fare nearly as well. So I stay away from the fish from Indonesia. I wanted to take a look at all of your yellow belly hippos. These are your yellow belly hippos. It's tons and tons of the yellow bellies from Africa. As you can see, uh, again, very important where they're from. You can see these are from Africa. And there's tons of yellow bellies, the hippos. And this is the palm trigger. This guy is about eight inches or so. A golden puffer, Christmas Island golden puffer. Let's see, we got harlequin tusks. Harlequin tusks, black triggers, more black triggers. This is cool. This is a tassel fish. Look at how cool the tassel fish is. And more good sized clown triggers. The Niger triggers. As well. And tons and tons of blue hippo tanks. Tons and tons of blue hippo tanks. More blue hippo tanks. And more blue hippo tanks. And look at more blue hippo tanks. These guys are awesome. Blue lines, more clowns, again from Bali, blue throat triggers, and Australian harlequin tusks. Along with Hawaiian blue, blue throat triggers. in those underlayers. Fiji fox faces, scribbled rabbits, orange rabbits, more of the Fiji fox faces, and let's see what else we have here. Fox faces and tons of fox faces. And these are the blonde nasos. Male blonde nasal tangs. 
And this is a an infamous black tang. More black tangs. More blondes. More blondes. More blonde nasals. For those of you who like grasses, this is the rosy scales. The rosy scale grasses. And these are your Catherine grasses. And these are your orange back fairy grasses. And let's see here from Baltiatus, which comes from Marshall Island. And these are the walking batfish, which are pretty neat. Most people have never seen a walking batfish. These guys are pretty neat. And we have the pintails.